covenant kid. I'm a covenant kid. I'm a covenant kid, and so are you. What's up, everyone? My name is Bella, and I am a covenant kid. God made us all so unique to do great things. I love to play guitar because it allows me to express myself and be free through my music while I'm worshiping God. This month, we're jumping into our Cove Kids core values. They tell us exactly what makes you and me a covenant kid. First, we learn that we love God. We love God because God is love and He first loved us. Next, we learn that we love people. We love people because God loves all people. And today, we're taking a look at our third core value, do your best. Everybody say, do your best. Awesome, right now, I want you to jump up to your feet and repeat the main point after me. Say, do your best and God does the rest. Great, now one more time a little louder. Say, do your best, and God does the rest. Great job, you can all have a seat. God has created you full of life and full of gifts. You are a masterpiece created by God. Our memory verse says this, I am God's masterpiece created new in Jesus to do good things He planned for me long ago. Ephesians 2.10. How incredible. God has had you in mind for a long time. Right now, I want you to repeat the memory verse after me. Say, I am God's masterpiece, created new in Jesus to do good things He planned for me long ago. Ephesians 2.10. Great job, Covenant Kids. We're getting ready to worship all together. But first, when I count down from three, I want you to tell three people around you your favorite song. Ready? Three, two, one, go.
winning, we winning, we winning, we winning. Let's get ready to do some searching, Cup Kids. You're gonna see a picture come on the screen just like this one. Somewhere in this picture, you'll find three hidden objects, and it's your job to find them. A countdown in the bottom of the screen will show you exactly how much time you have left. We will play five rounds. Covenant kids, be sure to get your eyes on the screen and put your threes up in the air. Ready? Three, two, one, search. Did you find all three hidden objects in the picture? Great! Ready for your next picture? Three, two, one, search. Did you spot all three? Awesome! Ready for your next picture? Three, two, one, search. Did you find all three hidden objects? Nice job. Ready for your next picture? Three, two, one, search. Did you spot all three? Great, one last picture coming your way. Three, two, one, search. Did you find all the hidden objects? Great job, everyone. We've had a blast with you during game time today. See you later. What's up, Covenant Kids? My name is Joanna, and it's so good to be with you today. What a great day it is, because today, we are jumping into our Covenant Kids core values. Basically, that means we are taking a look at what it means for you and me to be a Covenant Kid. Now, this doesn't necessarily mean that you always go to Covenant Kids Church. In fact, some of you have never even been here before. Being a Covenant Kid means even more than that. It means that you and you and you and you and you and I, well, we all have special promises from God. So how we respond to these amazing promises, that makes you and me a Covenant Kid. These are called our core values. Let's take a look. A few weeks ago, we learned our first core value. What makes you and me a covenant kid? Do you remember what that was? That's it. Say, love God. Everybody say, we love God because God is love. And He first loved us. Great job. Last week, we learned our second core value, love people. Everybody say, we love people because God loves all people. That's it. Today, we are looking at our third Covenant Kids core value. Do your best. That is our main point this week. So everybody, jump up to your feet and repeat this after me. Say, do your best, and God does the rest. One more time. Say, do your best, and God does the rest. Great job, everyone. You can take a seat wherever you are. So what does it mean to do your best? Does that mean we have to be the best? Does that mean everything we do should be done perfectly? Or we do half of our homework and then wait for God to pick up the pencil to finish our math problems for us? That would be pretty crazy. A pluses all around. But that's not exactly what it means. Oh, come on! That's it, I will figure this out. What's going on? 
going on? Let's go check it out. Ow! Oh! 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 Hey guys. Um, what? What are you? What are you doing, Harden? Well, our grandma bought us this really cool tent for epic movie nights, camping in the backyard. You know, fun things that should be fun. But we cannot get this set up right. So I resorted to the old scrunchie in a bed sheet method. I don't want to give up, but man, could they have shown us how to set this thing up? Wait, wait a second. Did it come with any instructions? Uh, Layla? Cannon. Layla? Cannon, did you see any instructions when you opened the box? Uh, I'd rather just nervously repeat your name. Okay, well, instructions would help you guys so much. But that reminds me, we can track those down later. For now, we've all got somewhere to be. Ready? Let's go. Okay, then. If you're out there watching and tuning in today, can you just give us a good woo 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 Okay, then. Let's batter up. <laughs> yeah, we just say that every time. We're not really making cake. <laughs> no, we sure are not. But, boy, do we have a treat for y'all today. We are a specializing in our good old breaking bakes. <laughs> you break it, you buy it. True, but... Not that at all. Okay, then. <laughs> By break and bake, today we mean we're gonna break down them walls of Jericho. Ha -ha! <laughs> and also bake some cookies. <laughs> but, but not these cookies. These are already done. We'll start completely over. <laughs> Studio and at home audience, if you're ready to get breaking and baking, let me see you do one more. Woo -ba -da, woo -ba -da, woo! Woo -ba -da, woo! -ba -da, woo! Yeah, I'd say now we could get started. Now, an integral part of this process will be to follow the directions, kids. Here in the baking world, we call that a recipe. Recipe for disaster could be. That's why we stick to these ready-made cookies. But we're gonna go ahead and jump into our breaking bottle story while we're at it. Ah, the recipe to victory. You woobalo woobalers in the studio and at home can join in at any point to help us with it. <laughs> When God chose a man named, well, Joshua to help bring all the Israelites to the promised land. But you see, there was a big old problem. The city was protected by walls thicker than a pregnant possum. No one came out and no one came in. But all that was about to change. Joshua started sending two spies in to fill it all out. Turn for her family's safety later on. Then Joshua got very specific instructions from the Lord. Take notes, everybody. A recipe, if you will, to help Joshua and his people conquer this city. Every single day for six days, Joshua and all his army and the Ark of the Covenant a big fancy box that held the presence of the living God back then. 
And all of the Israelites were to march and march and march and march and march. Around the city for six whole days. Ooh, now y'all getting excited because on the seventh day, change it up. Switch the roll, flip the tire, cook something other than roadkill because... On that seventh day, they were to march around the city seven times. Then they were to blow their seven trumpets. Do -do -do -do. And yell at the top of their lungs. story. I love that God gave Joshua the perfect recipe. God set it up so he could step in and help the Israelites. He didn't ask them to bulldoze through the walls. He simply asked them to march, to play, doo -doo -doo -doo, and to shout a shout of victory. God did the rest. Just like Joshua, God takes our best and he does the rest. We just follow the recipe and he'll turn it into a masterpiece. This means we follow what God's Word says to us, and He shows up in every situation. We pray to Him, and He'll show up with our best answer. When we worship Him, He helps bring us peace and understanding. When we say yes to our good things He planned for us long ago, He does more with our life than we could ever imagine. We do our best, and God does the rest. Our memory verse says this. It says, I am God's masterpiece created new in Jesus to do good things He planned for me long ago. Ephesians 2.10. Repeat this memory verse after me. Say, I am God's masterpiece, created new in Jesus to do good things He planned for me long ago. Ephesians 2.10. Great job. God made you so incredibly special. He calls you His masterpiece. He has an incredible plan for you, just like He had a special plan for Joshua to take back the promised land. So we're gonna take a moment and ask God to speak to us. He might remind you how much He loves you or what it looks like to do your best. You can go ahead and close your eyes so that all distractions around you go away. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for this day. Thank you for every single covenant kid watching today. Help us to always wanna do our best for you. We are your Covenantkins, and we are listening to what you have to say right now. That's amazing, Covenant Kids. When God speaks, it changes everything, and we believe you will continue to hear from Him. Today, you have the chance to say, God, help me do my best for you, and I trust you to do the rest. If that's you, I want you to repeat this after me. Say, God, I thank you for making me your masterpiece. I wanna do my best and trust you 
to do the rest in my life. I am your covenant kid, and I love you. In Jesus' name, amen. We are so excited for the good things God planned for you so long ago. We are excited to keep worshiping with you today. So let's stand up to our feet and worship all together.
hanging out with you today. We're praying for you and with you, believing God will show us more of who we are, His covenant kid and His masterpiece. Here in a minute, you will find today's small group questions, main point, and memory verse on the screen. We encourage you to take a moment to have a small group as a family. For additional resources, such as take-home cards, coloring pages, and bookmarks, check out the Children's Ministry on the Cuff Life app or the Covenant Kids YouTube page. You can also follow us on Facebook or Instagram, at Cove underscore kids. Have a great week, everyone. We'll, we'll see, see you later. later. Covenant kid. I'm a covenant kid. I'm a covenant kid, and so are you. 